Hi y'all, my name's Derek. I am your Sephora Collection Education Artist based out of Houston, Texas, and I'm here today with my beautiful model, Soraya. How are you doing today? Well, I'm doing great. You are doing great. Yes. So Soraya just moved back from Paris five months ago. She's here today to help me with our new Trend to Try video focusing on soft, natural brows. Now, how do you say soft, natural brows in French? So it's des sourcils naturels. Stay tuned for that. <laughs> So for our first step, we're gonna choose the right pencil in our brow assortment from Sephora Collection on Soraya's brow today for our soft, natural brow look. Now I'm gonna be using the Sephora Collection Waterproof Brow Shaper Pencil in Soft Charcoal. If you want more precise definition, you can use the Sephora Collection Waterproof Retractable Brow Pencil. This one has more of an ultra-fine point, so you can get more precise definition. The Brow Shaper Pencil has more of a triangle larger point, so I can really fill in the brow where needed. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna brush the brow hairs down. This will help us to see the natural shape of her brow. And then using the Brow Shaper Pencil by Sephora Collection, I'm just going to fill in the arch as needed. This brow shaper pencil has a really wide triangle shape at the end, so it's really easy to fill quickly when you don't have a lot of time. And sometimes a natural brow only takes a few easy steps. So we're filling in the back part of the brow, the arch only. We're not playing with the front of the brow just yet. That'll come later. And now we're gonna do the exact same step on the other side. And now that I've finished on the other side, I'm just taking a quick look for symmetry. Beautiful. So Soraya, we talked a little bit earlier about brow grooming habits, and you told me that you used to pluck your brows a lot. Yes, way too much, until a friend told me, what are you doing? So then I stopped. <laughs> well, luckily, we have the Brow Shaper Pencil, which will help to fill in that sparseness. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna brush the brow hairs up. This does two things. It will cover any product that we don't wanna see, from when we filled in the above part of the arch, and now we can use the Brow Shaper Pencil to fill in the underside as needed. If you're not sparse on the underside of the arch, you don't have to fill in as much. And keeping it soft in the front. Again, this is a soft, natural brow, so most of your definition will be in the arch. And we're gonna repeat the same step on the other brow in order to keep our symmetry right. Brushing the hairs up and then using the pencil to fill in underneath, again, as needed. So Raya, you're not as sparse on this side. You must have plucked the other eye a little bit more. I guess, that shows my skills. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. Let me just take a quick look for symmetry. Beautiful. And now it's time for step three, where we're gonna add some defining definition and dimension to the brows with our Sephora Collection Brow Volumizing Fiber Mascara in medium brown. Now I learned this tip from David, the Sephora beauty director, that you should go a couple shades lighter with a brow mascara in order to add dimension that will make the brows look fuller. So that's why I chose this lighter shade for you. And so right, this brow mascara is actually enriched with microfibers, so it's gonna help to add volume, to fill in, and give you the extra definition that you want. Oh, wonderful. And with the brow fibers, this is where you're gonna give definition to those front hairs. It's gonna make them look wider and thicker. Beautiful. All right, so let's jump to the next side and repeat our step. Focusing in the front, filling in, defining those front hairs. Those are very important. We want them to be soft, but we still want to see them and then working the brow mascara back towards the tail of the brow. So for our fourth and final step, we're gonna be using our Sephora Collection Bright Future Gel Serum Concealer in Parfait in order to clean up anything around the brow and to emphasize the arch. And for this step, I'll be using the Sephora Collection Pro 45 Concealer Brush. It's small for great detail work. So I take a little bit of concealer on the back of my hand, and then using the Pro 45 Concealer Brush, I'm just going to apply a little bit of concealer under the arch of the brow and above. This helps to give a little bit more definition around the brow and clean up any brow product that we got on the skin. And then just repeat on the other side. Thank you for joining us today for our Trend to Try video on soft natural brows. I hope you learned some new tips or tricks that will help you out. Please leave your favorite brow product in the comments below and we'll see you next time. See ya. Bye.